welcome to my channel. I am designed by Tola, and in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to draft a basic sleeve pattern. So let's get started. And in drafting a basic sleeve pattern, the first thing you're going to need are your basic measurements. And the basic measurements you're going to be needing are your sleeve length, your half hole, your bicep, both the length and the circumference, your elbow, both the length and the circumference, your wrist, both the length and the circumference. <laughs> Now for this tutorial, the sleeve length I'm going to be working with is 18 inches. So this is my shoulder line, my base line. So I'm going to be taking my measurements from this line. Now I'm going to be measuring out my bicep, which is 5 inches. Then to my elbow, 12 inches. Then to my sleeve length, 18 inches. I'm just going to repeat measurements here also. which is the round um, upper hand circumference and for this my bicep is 12.5 I'm going to divide 12.5 by 2 which is going to give me 6.25 and this is 6.25 here the next thing is my elbow so my elbow my elbow is 11.5 inches divided by 2 it's going to give me 5.25 5.25 and the next thing I'm going to do now for this my sleeve leg which is my wrist and mine divided by two is four and a half. So after I've gotten got all these measurements in this, the next thing I'm going to do is to rule out. So after I'm done with that, the next thing I'm going to do now, I'm going to draw imagine this point to this point. This point to uh, this point. And I'm going to do that with my straight finger. So after I'm done with that, and I'm going to be measuring from this point to this point. So this is 8 inches. So 8 inches is going to divide it by 2, which is going to give me 4 inches. On this 4 inches mark, I'm going to come up by half of an inch. This is half of an inch. Come by half of an inch. So on this half of an inch, we're going to draw a straight line from this half of an inch mark to this point on my bicep line. After I'm done with that, then from here to here, I'm going to be using my curved view or my free hand sketch to draw a curved line. So after I'm done with that, then the next thing I'm going to do now. This is going to be the back. And for the front now, I'm going to measure this same line. I'm going to divide it by two, which is two inches. For this two inches mark, I'm going to come in by half of an inch here, half of an inch there. Then this same line, I'm going to divide it by two also. I'm going to divide it by two. And I'm going to come up here by half of an inch on this line. I'm going to come up by half. Of an inch on one line. So now I'm going to be tracing out my so that way, and I'm going to be tracing. I'm just going to be tracing out my lines with my marker. So now I've traced out all my lines with the marker. So after I'm done tracing the next thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to cut it out. So I'm going to cut that is why I used marker to um, trace out the lines where I will be cutting out. So the next thing for me to do now is to cut out the lines.
then the next thing is to cut the front. So as you can see guys, so this is what uh, this, this is how our sleeve is looking like. So the difference is that this front I am um, this front, this is the front here. And for this other side is the back. And that is the, this is the back. So you can see the way the, the slope is. This is for the back and this is for the front. So the, the, this front was give you this S shape. So this is this is where we go underneath your armpit. This pop area is where we go underneath your armpit. Right here is going to come over your shoulder. Because since the front, the front there is the, uh, you have bust in the front. So that is why the bust is that is because of the bust at the front. That is why this at front has to come in a little bit more than the back. So the back is having that straight curve down, while the front is having this S shape. It must give you an S shape. So this S shape is going to avoid your armpit from having from um, giving you that one point effect. This is how to cut a basic sleeve pattern. So I hope you find this tutorial very very helpful. If you found this tutorial helpful, if this tutorial, if this tutorial has been helpful to you, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell so that you get notified when I post new videos. Thank you for stopping by. Um, you're most welcome. See you in my next video. Bye bye.